Hello everybody, welcome and thank you for joining me for another gameplay video. Today we're going to be taking a look at Saturn Bomberman, which, as the name suggests, is the version of Bomberman that was released for the Sega Saturn console. Uh, it's a version of Bomberman that I've never actually played before. I am a bit of a fan of the Bomberman series, but this one seems to have eluded me until now. I've not played it until today. But my experiences of playing other Bomberman games in the past have prepared me quite well for this game because I found when I started the game uh, everything seemed familiar to me. The controls were quite intuitive based on my experiences of the previous games and um, I recognised what I was supposed to do or what the power-ups represented. I didn't have any difficulty at all getting into this game. And I think that is uh, what I experience with Bomberman games in general. I think it has an easy point of entry for beginner players and experienced players alike. Now if you've played this game in the past then please let me know in the comments how you feel about it, how it stands up against other Bomberman games in this series. If you like the video feel free to hit that like button and if you feel so inclined if you consider the channel worthy then consider subscribing so you can see more from me in the future. Now this isn't a complete playthrough I didn't make it all the way through to the end but I'll let you see how far I got. I didn't do too badly I did quite well I think for a first time player but I'm gonna shut up now and let you see for yourself how well I did. Now I hope you enjoy it. Let's get started.
Man. The three remaining crystals have been hidden in the past. Take the Keppel to find them. The second crystal is hidden in the Samurai world.
third crystal is hidden in the Wild West. Hurry, Bomberman.